Hello and welcome to the Geek Club. And please make yourselves a cup of tea and sit down while I beguile you with a tale for a change of good luck by me. Because Neil Simpson, the dude that he is, likes to send me links of local computers and stuff. And he found this one which said, case only, £15. So I contacted the guy. I said, is it the case only or is the parts in there? Is any of it working? He said, it's case only. The motherboard is burnt and it's got no power. So what I'm assuming there is that when he says case only, it meant it's got the bits in. So that's a bit strange. But yes, so I assumed this has a PSU in. Uh, advertised as G5. And I thought, well, my other G5 down there has a dead PSU, so this might come in handy. Uh, for parts for that and you grab memory and stuff out of it so I said well it's got a dead motherboard possibly dead PSU can I give you 10 quid for it so he says yeah okay so off I go 40 and 40 minute drive all social distancing protocols observed and pick this up uh, on the way there he sent me a photograph of it which I'll show you here and I was like, mm, that doesn't look like my G5, but we'll continue. It would be a parts machine, whatever. So I get there, take the part, I was like, this is not G5. And in the meantime, uh, Neil Simpson had looked at the photograph and recognised it for what it is, a Mac Pro. So instead of getting a G5, we got a dead Mac Pro. But Mac Pros are superior to G5, so mm, nice. And it's a dual core Xenon... Uh, 2.0 with default uh, one meg sorry one gigabyte of server memory it's posh memory and 250 gig hard drive this doesn't have didn't have a hard drive in he did say he wouldn't be including the hard drive so he said he said no power motherboard burnt had a quick look at the motherboard uh when I put it in the cars I was no damage to the motherboard okay, I can see so I got it back and it uh, applied power to it, at which point nothing booted, but the power light fl flashed rapidly, which is memory issues. So I take it apart. The memory, uh, some of it's out of its slots, the boards are loose, and the video card is loose. Uh, so I reseat all that, press the old power button, and well. We'll show you what she does. Yes, yeah, a nice loud fan, that isn't it? I do appreciate that noise. I'm gonna have to get that doubt and see what's causing that. But uh, it is trying to boot. Uh, it's reading the hard drive, but this hard drive appears to have had Ubuntu on it, so it's trying to boot Ubuntu. So what I'm going to do is reboot the bugger. I think you hold down the command key. And I have prepared a copy of uh, Snow Leopard for it on this USB stick to SD card thingy. So, what I'm going to do, be quiet. It takes a few seconds. I think there might be a bearing gun in that. <coughs> uh, it's working. So I'll put that in there. We'll then switch it back on and hold down the command key. And that should take it to the boot menu. Hopefully it'll find that. And we can very quiet on the bong. Don't know why. Hopefully. Boot menu. Well. Okay, it looks like it's getting there. We've got our Apple symbol. Wide vision, not narrow for this. It wasn't there before, so it looks like it's going in the right direction. Get the screen a bit longer and uh, hopefully we'll get in the boot menu. It's taking time about it, but oh, it's thinking. Yay. Cool. Some no. Right. Okay. We are here at the boot menu. Click, 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 click. Hope you like the clicking sound. Uh, I may try and get that loud later in the video and see about repairing that if I can. Uh, English for the main language. Okay. Oh, 
Let me sort the camera out. Right, I now have all my power leads better organised and uh, back on that one. Bearing installation. It looks like it's gone straight forward. Okay, I'm impressed. So what we have to do apparently, utilities, uh, disc utility, and we'll give it an 80 gig drive, so we need to erase that. I should just confirm, well it's got a DVD as well, and that's where we're installing from. So we need to uh, erase this, so we'll do that. Just going to confirm with the other computer what setup I need, hang on. Okay, I've uh, had a look and we need Mac OS Extended Journal. There we go, and I shall call it RGVX uh, Mac Pro. And erase, erase. All right. We'll wait for that to do and then uh, we'll come back. 80 gigs a little bit small. I might just redo it with a bigger drive and if I can find one at some point. But they just can't be choosers and that will have to do it for now. Oh, it's done it. Right, okay. That's quick. Let's get this thing installed then. Uh, continue. Continue. Agree. I want it there. Uh, printer support, Ooh, language translations, don't need that. X11, double errors. Ooh, okay, whatever. That's only small. So, go. Right, we are installing. Hurrah! I shall uh, come back when there's something interesting. Okay, I just had the lights off while it was doing itself. Hey. But uh, here we are, slightly later, and the infamous intro on here, and it's going to on the sound. I don't honestly thought that these would have better sound than this, when I consider that the G4s had much better sound. Mm, some tiny speaker down the bottom. So let's set up, shall we? We are United Kingdom, continual. We are British. Continue. Do you already own a Mac? Uh, no. 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 Do not. Continue. Do I own a Mac? <laughs> May have a couple. <clears throat> oh, it's got the network. Hey. All right. I'll have to go get that network, shan't I? Hey. Okay. Uh, we've clicked the network. Set up an account, it actually let me set up an account through this computer. Don't know why I did that, but there you go. Thank you, your Mac is ready to use and so you can now do, 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 do. go. Let's see that desktop. Snow Leopard desktop. Uh, we have a theory that it may try and update itself to uh, Mountain Lion, you never know. Hmm. Yeah, never know, do you? There we go. There's the desktop. Excellent. £10 for what was a broken iMac. <laughs> Not quite. Uh, let me see. Chelsea. Chelsea for the disc eject. I can't remember now. Um, go. Uh, view. Uh, That's noisy. Being desktop to disk. No. No. Just trying to get. I can't remember the keyboard characters to do that. Oh well. I shall be right back. Okay. I didn't need to remember. We got. Uh, yeah. We got a hotkey on the keyboard that does it for us. Now I just need to find some sort of disk to test that. Uh, do -do 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 -do. Doopy doopy doo, but no Mac software. Try music CD and I'll tell you if it works. Hang on, I know I deserve to die for this, but. How about a bit? Too unlimited. 
because the drawer doesn't want to come back in. Where's it gone? It's up there. Okay. Right, That's one bug it's got. We can sort that out. Is it reading? I really can't tell. It's making noises. But not much else. Could be the disc, could be the drive. Hmm. Yeah, well, I think it's up there. Well, it doesn't appear to want to read that. Oh. Yep, don't think it likes that one. Although it does very scratch, so we'll try another one. Uh, later on another thing. Let's get that back down now. Bugger. Yeah. It is actually quite dark here. Yeah. Grot. Right. Okay, let's do something before we shut this down and try and clean that and sort that out. Let's have a look. Software update. See what it does. See if Apple provide any software updates for this. So we shall install them before we proceed, and then I think we shall... Software updates available for your computer. Yes! Show details. Let's have a look what we've got. Live support, airport, Mac, OS, update combined, iTunes, remote desktop client. Let's have a look at this one. Can you see? The Tempo 6.8 update is recommended for users using Snow Leopard and includes general operating systems like enhanced stability, compatibility and security on Mac. Who says Mac don't update? Enhance the Mac App Store to get your Mac ready to upgrade to Mac OS Lion. Ooh! Solve issues. Uh, install. Please. Agree. Uh, should remember password as I only just set it. Right, 1.2, four, four minutes. Oh no, oh no, Whoa. two minutes, something like that, to download that. Then, once that's done, we'll have a look at the on it on YouTube, and then we'll try and <laughs> shut this bloody fan up. And I'll get that door down, because I doubt I'm going to use that very often at all, especially as it's got USB storage. Great, okay, I'll be back. Whoop. Yeah, you were zoomed in, so yeah. Gonna get that down. I doubt I'll use the DVD drive because it's got USB, so I can just use that. Don't need DVD. We'll see if we can do anything about this ticking and have a look at it. See how it performs on YouTube. Okay, quick update. Uh, I managed to get the DVD drawer closed. It turns out it goes down, so it's just a bit stiff, and I've managed to free it up and push it open. It's fine. And the fan suddenly got much quieter. Although I changed my plans, once this has done its update, I'm going to power this down and see about that fan. Uh, if I can't shut it up, if it's not something simple, I'm just going to unplug the bugger because it should be alright. Because these, unlike the G5 forever then, tend to run much cooler, so it shouldn't be an issue. We shall see. Oh, there it is rebooting. Alright, I'll be back. Right, I was going to... Uh, just down and sort out the fan, but it appears we have another round of uh, updates here from our friends at Apple. Let's see what they've sent us this time. Uh, show details. This mask on here is show details. We have Apple software upstairs. Ooh, Apple software installer update, iTunes, Safari, security update, and Java. Mac, Mac App Store update for OS Snow Leopard, Migration Assistant to a Mac. Ah, this update provides compatibility for migrating a Mac running, sorry, to, up to a Mac running OS X Mavericks. Okay. We shall do that then. Uh, do we have an App Store yet? No, can't see one. Have a look. He did say about uh, something to do with the App Store in the last one, but oh, there it is. 
We've got an app store. Wonder if it works. Hang on. Quickly. First of all. Ha! <laughs> yep, we've got a working app store. Well. Mac OS, OS Catalina. Let's get that. Oh, no. Might not quite work. But anyway, let's let it do its next round of uh, updates. And okay, that update is done. Now it wants us to download Flash. Uh, hmm, don't know if this is going to be the latest version. I shall see when it does. Oh, it's going to the website. Hmm. I wonder what's it going to do. Let's have a look. Select an operating system. This could be interesting. I wonder if it work with this operating system. Uh, Mac OS 10.10. <coughs> I don't think we're anywhere near 10.10. 10.6, so no. No, you're not going to get that version. Unless we'll find an older version. <coughs> Hello. Nope. Not today, my friend. So, um, it's not saying it needs any more updates at the moment. So let's shut it down and see about shutting this up. Back in a bow. Okay, it's a while later. Uh, it did take quite a while to get his fans out. And this is the state of the fans. Although, if I spin them, there's no obvious uh, signs or anything. Uh, the back one, <coughs> sorry, the back one is not so easy to remove. Yeah, but I have powered the units on and that's not making any clicking noise, so we notice these ones. What is clicking, I do not know. But what I am going to do is give them a thorough clean. That might help. Back in a mole. Right, I have cleaned them up as best as I can. They're never going to be perfect. I believe we do not have scrubbed, but yeah. All the dirt is off. And there's some up there. On that spine I missed. I have to clean those spines at the back. Bugger. But anyway, let's see, I can do that in here. But got some compressed air and I'm using the phone to light up the case, so I thought you might see a quick look around, although it doesn't seem to make much difference. Just a quick one and I'll get some wipes and I can wipe it around too. Doesn't make much difference to them. Just be spit out more fluid in there. Got some pound land stuff. Right, we'll wipe around and do all that and put this back together. Okay, I've put it back together and now's the moment of truth. Have I buggered it and it's not gonna boot? And has that fan shut up? Because I couldn't find any obvious reason. So maybe my bit of cleaning and fiddling has cleared that up. Probably not know my look, but let's have a look. No flashing lights, good sign so far. And the answer to that is no. It hasn't solved the fan noise issue. That's weird. That is bloody weird. I can't even shut them up because they are... Uh, hmm. They're hardwired sort of thing. You can't just pull them out. Well, you can pull the fans out. Completely. Well, that's not fired up fast, isn't it, Christ? Hmm. I may have to find a temporary solution to this. I'll be right back. Okay, so what I've done, taken the fans out and I've put tape on the blades on that one to stop it spinning. I'm told that without that fan it should be okay because these don't get hot and, and all the time I've been installing stuff and stuff it's never spun up its fans above idle. So hopefully that'll be alright and let's see if she starts. Oh, nice and quiet. That's been quiet. Purring like a kitten. See how fast that starts, actually, because I got distracted last time and... 
Let's see. Do, 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 do. Oh, there is an issue here. I haven't put the hard drive back in. Oh. Okay, right. Hard drive replaced. Let's try again. Now I can hear the hard drive stored up. That is good. Disappointed with the tone art. I thought it would have been really good, but it is not. See the top fan span, uh, top span, top fan spinning. And it shouldn't take long to boot up. And then we can have a look. Uh, we'll just use, excuse me, YouTube on the default built-in browsers. As it was made for back in the day. Here we go to the desktop. Oh, that's fast. Okay. Let us have a look at YouTube on Safari. How quick does Safari boot up? Very damn quick. And let's just, is it going to go and, yep, uploading the latest uh, Apple website. Yeah, too much issue. Okay, let's test it. It's actually got YouTube on the things here, which is a bit strange. Please update your browser. <laughs> um, okay. Hmm. This ain't going to work on here, is it? I'm going to have to get uh, but Firefox won't get the latest Firefox browser today. Uh, your system doesn't meet the requirements to run Firefox, and I forgot what the other ones are called. Um, hmm. Is it ten? No. Oh, I've made it on the G4. Uh, I shall look that up, and I shall get it, and we'll be back. Okay, I've been uh, playing around, trying different browsers, and I've got Chrome to uh, install, which is quite amazing. Yeah, I want a smaller window, please, because I don't need to see that. There we go. Right, so this is my first attempt at Google, and uh, let's see if there's any handsome fellas here. I'm sure this gentleman won't mind me. I mean, look how fast it goes on this. It's, it's really good. But now the question is, how's YouTube going to run? Okay. Uh, answer. That's running on 720p. And it's fine. Wow. I'm genuinely impressed. I did not expect that. That's Mr. Benway. If you're not subscribed to him, like everybody is, go and do it anyway. Okay, right, so uh, that took me by surprise, I didn't expect that. That runs absolutely fine. So let's see if we can find any 1080p video. Uh, there's a gentleman here who does 1080p. Look how fast it's going. It's going faster than me, bloody one downstairs. I don't know. Let's see what this guy's like. Wow. It's no issues. That funny looking fellow. Try to get 1080p. In full screen. Set alone. And, wow. It's working fine. Genuinely surprised. Wow. Okay. Did not expect that. Okay. So, that is working absolutely fine on YouTube. So, this is my phishing video on scam emails and stuff. So, yes. £10 for working uh, Mac Pro from 2007, I think it was. Six, 2006. Uh, fixed. With no major issues. Just got a little clunking noise now and again. I think it's that fan trying to boot. Uh, so in the next video, uh, we'll try some games on it, shall we? And we'll benchmark it, stuff like that. And I believe there are also already plans, if to uh, 
Do, 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 do you find updates for this machine? Uh, fast hardware for it. Uh, somebody is planning evil stuff because the hardware for this is dirt cheap to buy. Yeah, it's conking. Makes a little. Do, do. Now I'm very quiet. I think that uh, fan's done trying to work well. Yeah, everything seems alright. What I should do is get uh, some sort of app. It does have the app store. I don't know if anything off the app store will work for it. Uh, being way out of date. I don't even know how far we can push the operating system to later versions. Uh, I don't know if anything off here will work. CPU temperature, that's the one. Ah, all right. Have we got any of that free? Because I'm cheap. System stats. Right, that's the only one. So look. Uh, create the living code for visualizations. Ooh, November 2015. Okay, let's see, as an experiment, if this will install and run. You never know. We cannot completely purchase this. Purchases cannot be installed on our Xbox Pro because OS X 10, 10 or later is required. There's your issue. But there's going to be a version of, of an app for Snow Leopard, so I'll look that up and I'll be bad. back. Right, welcome back. After much experimentation, uh, the only thing I've been able to find that works is, what's it called? Hardware monitor, which is showing these values for the temperatures. Uh, I don't know how good they are. It's only in the heatsink, it's not in the, the chip itself. Couldn't get those drivers to install, but uh, that's what it's showing while playing 1080p videos, so I don't know how good that is. If anybody knows, please let me know. Apart from that, yes, uh, I believe there are already processes in the process of being processed for this. So we shall do some uh, videos of this. I've also, just close these off, look professional. Yeah. I've also got an SSD downstairs, so what we may do is benchmark this and then put the SSD in, run it off that, just for the hell of it, to see how it goes. That could actually be fun, so I may do that as another video. And uh, if you've got any suggestions on upgrades, software you want to see running on this, anything you want to see me doing with this, I know some are going to say throw it in the bin because you, yeah, anyway, but any serious suggestions? Then please leave them in the comments or anything else you want to tell me about these that I don't know that might be a surprise. Other than that, yes, look forward to some uh, projects upgrading this and doing different things with it. That works a hell of a lot faster than I thought it was going to. Wow. So, other than that, uh, if you enjoyed the channel, if you enjoyed the video, then please like it. Uh, also, subscribe and hit the notification bell so they actually tell you I made videos. Join us on Facebook, Twitter, and all that. And uh, thank you very much for watching. What a bargain! You need to quit being dirty. You're a dirty boy. <laughs>